I want to thank you for tuning in to learn a little bit more about telomeres and telomerase. This is the greatest scientific and medical breakthrough in history. I don't say that lightly. I say that because if you take a look back at what happened on November 28th of 2010, scientists succeeded in reversing the age in mice. I can't say that. I, I literally try to keep down on that because I get so excited. This is the biggest thing going in medical history right now. This has shocked scientists and medical in the medical community across the world. Uh, it was the Ronald DePinho Labs up in Boston at the Dana-Farber Cancer Institute right at Harvard Medical School. Uh, again, this became the biggest news, and everything that you're going to see today, you're going to be able to cross-check on Google or YouTube or whatever right on the Internet because this is unsolicited third-party information. I'm going to dish out just facts today, but again, we can't reverse the age in humans, obviously, but we can do similar things, and that's what I'm going to talk to you about today as, as well as the science. Now, most people don't really understand just how big of a deal this really is or really how it's possible. So let's just take, here's a human body right here, and inside the human bodies, you know, we have trillions of cells, and inside those cells we have a proton nucleus, and dotted in here a bunch of what we call X chromosomes. Here's an X chromosome blown up right here. Now, what are we focused on? We're focused on the tips of these chromosomes, okay? The tips of the chromosomes are called telomeres. But if you magnify these telomeres up, what you see is you see these long, what they look like DNA strands, these long tails, we'll call them. These tails are divided into what we call units. If we do 15,000 basis points, okay, I'm going to put 15K right here. Here's the deal on telomeres and telomerase. I'm going to give it to you basically. Every time our cells divide and rebuild, every time they divide and then rebuild, they can replicate themselves almost identically except for one little facet. The very, very end of that tail, let's call it a slinky link. You guys remember a slinky, right? Like a little slinky link is taken off. So it can replicate everything perfectly except for just one little link or one little basis point. And then what happens? Those, those cells divide and they replicate again, and those divide and replicate again, and those divide and replicate again. And as the process continues, we continue to lose length off these telomeres. It is stated that by the time we are born, right here, one-third of this tail is already gone by the time we're born. By the time we die, another third is gone. We're down to 5,000 basis points. If you're to stretch this, this right here is one of an old person about to die. If you're to stretch this thing out here, it's about one-third left. Every human being around the time of death has about one-third of a telomere left. Now, that's outside of people dropping dead of a heart attack or cancer or some, uh, some um, you know, upsetting thing like that. But everybody, if they die of old age, has about 5,000 basis points is what scientists say. These, these right here are obviously your telomeres under uh, – your, your X chromosomes and telomeres under microscope. But this has become such a big deal because science actually went back and they thought, well, let's think about this. If this is the time clock inside the human body, and you're going to hear this over and over again now in the media, the shortening of telomeres is the time clock. They know that as a fact. It's the time clock inside the human body. So what they said was this. Well, wait a minute. If the shortening leads to death, what if we could stop these telomeres from shortening? Could we stop the aging process? That's theory number one. Theory number two is a little bit more like science fiction, kind of like Back to the Future. Wait a minute. What if we could find the enzyme to telomeres, and we could add length possibly back to these tails or back to these, these telomeres here? Could we reverse age as we know it? Now, that obviously sounds like science fiction, something like on Star Wars or Back to the Future, but that was the theory going in. Well, lo and behold, here comes... This gentleman right here, Dr. Bill Andrews, again, write his name down, go Google him, go YouTube him. He's everywhere now, all over the Internet, because, again, this is the greatest discovery known to man. This is a big, this is bigger than the, the first heart transplant uh, when you reverse the age. Because you've got to keep in mind, since the beginning of time, again, everybody's been looking for the fountain of youth or the elixir of life. And, and we're here, guys. I mean, we are right on the precipice of finding this. Now, again, we cannot reverse the age in humans, but we can do similar things. Lo and behold comes Dr. Bill Andrews. And for the last 20 years, 
this is a molecular biologist. This is what he has been doing. His goal in life is to find a cure to aging or at least get the average human to live to 150 years old because we should live to at least 125, but we don't. We've succeeded in raising that age limit to around the mid-70s, but still it's the mid-70s. We should almost live double that. So that has been his mission. This gentleman has been, he has sat on boards all across uh, the world on different things, but he also has been the director of some pretty big companies. And, and the number one company he really sat on before owning his own company was Geron Corporation, Big Labs. And when he was at Geron Corporation, he succeeded in the 90s, in the late 90s, to find the active form of the enzyme to telomeres, which they call telomerase. Okay, so I'm going to tie the two together. And what telomerase actually does, this enzyme does, it's an enzyme that adds DNA sequence repeats to the ends of the DNA strands of telomeres. And so potentially lengthening telomeres. That's the goal. That's the theory. Well, they tested that as I showed you. And lo and behold, when, when, uh, again, when Dr. Bill Andrews was at Geron Corporation, and again, he isolated, and he's the one who discovered the active form, the active enzyme of telomerase, Geron Corporation and Dr. Bill felt it necessary to get that information to labs all over the world. And lo and behold, about a year later, a year and a half later, in 2000, or a couple of few years later in 2009, the Nobel Prize is won for medicine. And you can see it right here for the discovery of how chromosomes are protected by telomeres and the enzyme telomerase. This became massive news. And from that... There you go. You've got, Rama, you've got other labs that went ahead and said, you know what, let's test this theory out. This right here, Nature, is a peer-reviewed medical journal, not just a medical journal. For those of you that know what peer-reviewed is, it's a much bigger deal. This is where it was, telomeres reverses aging process. And it talks about how uh, Ronald DePinho up there at Harvard was able to reverse the age in mice, reverse the age in mammals. And again, it's been all over the Internet. Here was something that was put out by Life Extension Magazine where it says here, Life Extension provides $2 million for new age reversal study. I want you to keep in mind, the new coin phrase is not anti-aging. The future is age reversal, and this is the start of it right here. So remember that. It's age reversal now. And it says here, until recently, no one thought it possible to reverse the consequences of aging in severely degenerated organisms. That all changed. Here's the date again, November 28, 2010 with the publication of a landmark report in the prestigious scientific journal Nature. In this unprecedented study, Harvard-affiliated researchers lengthened telomeres in aging mice and achieved rapid reversal of genetically programmed organ and tissue degeneration caused by short telomeres. The aged mice showed new brain cell growth, restored sexual function and fertility, and regeneration in every tissue examined. So again, when I say they reverse their age, I'm talking everything from their brain to their blood to their hair, skin, and nails. They reversed their age, literally backed it up. So this became, again, very, very, very big news. Let me take you on. Here's ABC News with Diane Sawyer. Let me play a clip here for you because, again, this has been everywhere. I'm going to show you many clips, I'm gonna, but I'm just going to show you one live. Let me take you here real quick. And now, eternal youth. Is it in a cage around the corner? News tonight of a breakthrough for some pioneering mice. But we always wonder, what does a fountain of youth for rodents reveal for humans? Here's Sharon Alfonsi reporting. I feel tremendous. In the movie Cocoon, it's a swimming pool that turns back the clock for a group of senior citizens. But now, researchers have found a way not just to stop, but reverse the aging process. The key is something called a telomere. We all have them. They're the tips or caps of your chromosome, seen here in yellow. This is what it looks like in a young adult. But as you grow older, the telomeres become damaged and frayed. And as they stop working, we start aging, experiencing things like hearing and memory loss. Scientists took mice who were prematurely aged, added an enzyme, and essentially turned their telomeres back on. You can see it before the enzyme, after. Their brain function improved, their fertility was restored. It was a, a remarkable uh, reversal of the aging process. Look at this picture. The mouse on the right has bad skin, gray hair, and is balding. But the one on the left had its telomeres flipped back on. And you could see that uh, essentially you now have a dark coat color, uh, that the hair uh, is restored, 
that the coat has a nice healthy sheen to it. Even more dramatic, the change in brain size. This is before the mice had 75% of a normal brain, like a patient with severe Alzheimer's. But after the telomeres were reactivated, the brain returns to normal size. As for humans, while it is just one factor, scientists now say by looking at our blood cells and measuring those telomeres, you can get a better idea of how well you'll age. The longer the telomere, the better the chances for a more graceful aging. But as for tinkering with them and turning back our aging process, researchers say we still have a long way to go. Sharon Alfonsi, ABC News, New York. Okay, so you can see that was one report right there. Let me take you to another one here. August issue of 2011, Popular Science Magazine. Look down here at the bottom. Why you'll live to 150 inside, it says the man who would stop time. Well, who do you think that is? It's the godfather of telomerase, Dr. Bill Andrews himself. And it talked, there's an 11 page article uh, on here talking about his 20 year mission. You know, the last 20 years, he has been trying to find. You know, his mission to extend the human lifespan to 150 years or die trying. Here's another article in L Magazine, August issue 2011. Look right down here where my cursor is. The new anti-aging pill. It works. This has become a very big deal. Inside this magazine, hey, want to live forever? And it says, more quickly than anyone imagined, Nobel Prize winning research is yielding promising compounds for fighting the inevitability of aging at the most fundamental cellular level. And it goes on again to talk about a five or six page in-depth article on it as well. I'm telling you this is the biggest sleeper you're ever going to find. This is gigantic because science and medicine kind of under wraps has been looking at this forever. It's now just coming out and this is the future. It is the future of youth. It's the future of health and it's definitely the future of science and medicine because they're going bananas on this. You just never knew it. Most of you didn't. There are some there is a couple of telomere support products out there that are viable. The first one that actually popped up a couple years ago was TA65. You can look them up going to TASciences.com. Their product is a natural product. It comes from an astragalus root, which is a plant out of uh, Asia, out of China. Here was the problem. The product started at $3,500 a month. Now, that's a nice mortgage payment. Sometimes a double mortgage payment for some people out there across the nation, for the average home out there, that's $40,000 a year. I mean, I don't know uh, who in their mind would pay that kind of money for something like this, but obviously there's your law of supply and demand at its finest. Didn't have much supply, had a heck of a demand, and there you go. The current price, they've come way down to $667. How do you do that, by the way? How do you offer something at $3,500 and then drop the price about 70, 80% down a, down a 650, 600, 700 bucks. Don't ask me. I mean, I, I still think it's ridiculously overpriced. That's still 8,000 bucks a year. There is another product out there that Dr. Bill Andrews has been working on very, very heavy. I want to draw your attention to the very, very bottom of this. It says he is presently a named inventor on 35 issued, uh, U.S. issued telomerase patents. Again, He's going to go down as one of the godfathers of telomerase, this technology or this, sci this, uh, this science. And he got together with a gentleman by the name of John Anderson, who's an internationally recognized formulator of a master formulator of nutritional supplements. And he's produced over 23, 2400 nutritional supplements for over 600 companies around the world. Uh, and his products are, are regarded as groundbreaking. Well, they put their heads together and they've come out with a product. That's a superior formulation. It's, uh, it's very extensive. It's all natural. Um, and there are very, very heavy studies going on right now over in Europe, uh, I've, I've been told. Look at the price. 79 bucks a month. Now, that's something the average family can afford, the average individual can, can afford. That's why I think this product, the entire world is going to want this product. They're going to want this product as it was just released. This is a huge deal. And it's not just one ingredient. It's many, 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 many ingredients, many extracts, some things that you've never even heard of. Uh, and a lot of them, obviously, are proprietary, but they are doing serious studies on this. Uh, they've been telling people that uh, you know we will be able to make claims on this product in the future. It's going to be a very, very big deal. It's sold through direct sales. So you've got to find a rep. The projection, 
they're going to do a billion dollars inside of a year and a half, two years. There's going to be hundreds of people, obviously, that are selling this stuff. I'm sure that will make millions of dollars. The question is, do you want to be one of them? Things are moving fast. There's no time to wait. What I would tell you to do is to get back with the person who shared this with you, and you need to take action immediately. I want to thank you for joining us here today. Take care of yourselves, and God bless.